All right, so what I'm gonna do here is gap the spark plugs. So these have, most NGK spark plugs are pre-gapped, um, but these need to be gapped to 1.1 millimeters. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this igniter right here, which is, um, if you have like a, a propane barbecue, this is pretty much the exact same thing uh, that starts your fire. This little, uh, um, what is this called? Igniter right here is what ignites the fuel in the vehicle. Um, a spark travels from the tip of this into the, well, it travels from this igniter through here and sparks the gas, which is pretty much the exact same thing that is in your barbecuer. Um, when you push that little button to start your barbecue, this is what ignites the fire in there. Um, so it's practically the exact same thing. Uh, I can't hold my phone and gap this at the same time, but I'm going to go ahead. And so what you do is you take this gapper and you slide it in between that spark plug and the uh, that little curved part. I don't know exactly what it's called. But you, you insert it in between the igniter and the curved piece of metal and you get it to, as you can see, this is 0 0.6, 0 0.8, 1.0, 1 1.2. So I have to put it right there at 1.1 millimeters for each of the four spark plugs. So I'm going to get that done and then we're going to change the wires. Uh, you do those one at a time because if you do them all at the same time and you fuck up the combination you'll have misfires um, or your car won't even start or it'll run like an absolute piece of junk so um, always do your spark plug wires one at a time